Episode 8, The Sixth Seal When the sixth seal is loosed from the book, it will send shock waves all over my once green earth. There is not a person alive on earth who will not recognize my hand at work in my day of judgment. And honestly, if you are alive and you do not know me, you will feel the shock of it. You will feel the horror of it. But if you are walking closely with me, know this, your time of honorable discharge, that is martyrdom, is coming quickly. Do not fail me now, for all who are truly following me, as you heard in the video Overcomers, will give their lives in faithful service in the martyrdom of the fifth seal. But this sixth seal might be released as the fifth seal is still playing out. And the sixth seal is dreadful. It is terrifying, and you might be on earth to see it, and I want you to prepare yourself for this. The sixth seal, as I have revealed elsewhere, is suddenly much worse than what has gone before, in the sense that it's obvious enough and strong enough a display of my power that everyone on earth will know it. Prior to this, perhaps the seals have been something that only the discerning were quite sure were even happening. Perhaps before the sixth seal, the hardships and events of the tribulation might have been fairly easily explained by other means. But the sixth seal will not be like the rest. By the time of the sixth seal, all will know, all will see me, and those who do not know me well will be terrified. For I will not be turning a kind eye toward them, but I will instead be showing them the eye of my displeasure. And it is a frightful thing to fall into the hands of an angry God, as one of your number once said. If you are hearing this treatise now, take the time to repent of that which you are doing that is displeasing to me. You know what it is, for I have been telling you, I am always faithful to provide you a way of escape out of all your difficulties. 1 Corinthians 13.10 So you know by this that I have been revealing what is displeasing to me about your life. Repent of it. Turn from it and receive my kind eye and my hand of blessing rather than my displeasure and the shock of my countenance turned upon you in my anger. You do not want to experience my anger. Believe me, you do not want to be found in this place at this time and not in me, not abiding in me. Learn now how to abide in the vine. There is yet a little time left. We have recommended obtaining the materials from Living Water Press. Get them read them, study them. They will do no harm in all my holy mountain. They will explain so much. Only believe them and act on them. You will be spared so much trouble if you do. We implore you, access these materials and live by them, and you shall be saved from the trouble that is coming quickly on the earth. There is yet a little time, and you have yet a little power. Employ it in studying what has gone before. You really could not be too diligent at this.